In the heart of Africa, a tale shrouded in mystery and intrigue unfolds, revealing the captivating story of Queen Nzinga Mbande, a figure of remarkable strength and cunning. Her journey intertwines with the enigmatic transformation of the land into what we know today as Angola. Welcome to the Unknown Paradox. Subscribe and follow us across social networks now and embark on a journey of captivating storytelling. In the 17th century, the Andongo and Matamba kingdoms thrived in what is now Angola. Amidst the lush landscapes and hidden secrets, Queen Zinga Mandand emerged as a formidable ruler, driven by an insatiable thirst for power and a desire to protect her people. Legend has it that Queen Zinga possessed supernatural powers bestowed upon her by the spirits of her ancestors. Whispers of her ability to commune with the mystical realm heightened her mystique, lending an air of otherworldly influence to her reign. As the Portuguese colonization of Angola gained momentum, Queen Zinga defied their encroachment becoming a symbol of resistance against European domination. Her strategic brilliance and fierce determination were legendary as she orchestrated a series of covert operations to weaken the Portuguese forces. Queen Nzinga's story is laced with tales of subterfuge and disguise. It is said that she often donned the guise of a male warrior leading her troops into battle with unmatched ferocity. Her true identity hidden beneath armor, her face veiled in mystery. She instilled fear in the hearts of her enemies, leaving them to ponder the enigma of this powerful woman who defied all odds. The land over which Queen Nzinga reigned witnessed the ebb and flow of power. Battles were fought, Alliances were forged, and secrets were whispered in the depths of the Angolan night. Yet, amidst the turmoil, Queen Nzinga stood resolute, a symbol of defiance and resilience. Before the Portuguese influence in the region grew stronger, Queen Nzinga's reign was marked by a tumultuous struggle against the expanding European presence. She fought fiercely to protect her kingdoms from the encroachment of Portuguese colonizers, employing both cunning diplomacy and military tactics to maintain her independence. Queen Nzinga recognized the need for strategic alliances to resist the Portuguese onslaught. She sought partnerships with neighboring African kingdoms that shared a common goal of repelling European domination. Through her enigmatic charm and persuasive skills, she forged alliances with powerful leaders who admired her strength and determination. As the Portuguese forces pushed further into Andongo and Matamba, Queen Zinzinga orchestrated a series of daring guerrilla attacks ambushing their supply lines and disrupting their attempts at expansion. Her warriors, guided by her mystical insights and strategic acumen, waged a relentless campaign against the invaders, striking fear into the hearts of the Portuguese soldiers. In a pivotal moment of defiance, Queen Zinga embarked on a diplomatic mission that would become the stuff of legends. She dressed in regal attire, radiating an aura of mystery and grace. With measured steps, she walked into a meeting with the Portuguese governor, a man who sought to impose his will upon her people. As she entered the room, adorned in her royal garb, the governor expected a submissive queen. Instead, he encountered a woman of immeasurable strength and resolve. Queen Zinga refused to sit on the lower seat that was designated for her, instead demanding an equal position to the governor. This act of defiance shocked the Portuguese, 
forcing them to acknowledge her as a formidable opponent. The negotiations that followed were a delicate dance of intrigue and manipulation. Queen Zynga used her sharp wit and charisma to outmaneuver the Portuguese governor, extracting concessions that safeguarded the autonomy of her kingdoms. But her triumph was temporary. It demonstrated her resourcefulness and unwavering commitment to her people. Despite facing numerous setbacks, Queen Zynga's resilience remained unyielding. She continued to rally her troops, inspiring them with her unwavering determination. Her strategic genius and fierce leadership ensured that her kingdoms remained a thorn in the side of the Portuguese invaders never allowing them to fully subjugate her people. Queen Nzinga's legacy as a symbol of resistance and independence continued to reverberate through the land. Her enigmatic persona and unwavering defiance against European domination inspired generations to come, fostering a spirit of resistance that would endure long after her time. While the Portuguese influence eventually grew stronger, Queen Enzinga's courageous efforts laid the foundation for future resistance against colonization in Angola. Her story remains a testament to the indomitable spirit of a woman who defied the odds and fought for her people, leaving behind a legacy steeped in mystery and unparalleled strength. As time passed, the Portuguese influence in the region grew stronger. The land that once bore the names Ndongo and Matamba gradually came to be known as Angola, but the echoes of Queen Zinga's indomitable spirit still reverberate, reminding the people of their rich history and the enigmatic queen who fought fiercely for their freedom. Today, the tale of Queen Nzinga Mambande continues to captivate hearts, evoking a sense of wonder and awe. Her legacy serves as a reminder that amidst the shadows of history lie stories of untold strength, mystery, and the enduring spirit of those who dared to challenge the world around them. As the sun sets over the land that is now Angola, the enigma of Queen Zinga, Mbande, remains a testament to the resilience of a nation and a testament to the power of a woman who defied the odds, leaving behind a legacy steeped in mystery and intrigue.